Let's see if we can run. It's Gavin and Connor. They're helping with my science experiment. We have two bottles. The bottle with the label has 7-Up in it. And the balloon on it has Pop Rocks. Pop Rocks is made by pumping carbon dioxide into the candy. And so when the candy is wet or crushed, the carbon dioxide comes out. Connor's bottle has vinegar and his balloon has baking soda. Now, when baking soda and vinegar mix, it doesn't release carbon dioxide that's already there. It makes its own carbon dioxide. There is one tablespoon of Pop Rocks. There is one tablespoon of baking soda. We're going to see which makes the most carbon dioxide. Ready? Ready. Go. And all your stuff is on me. <laughs> Gavin, now all your stuff is on in. Don't be scared of it. Here, I'll do it for you. There you go. So, do you think if you ate a packet of Pop Rocks and drank a bottle of soda, your stomach would explode? No. No. What about if you ate a tablespoon of baking soda and drank a cup of vinegar? Maybe. It just might. Think your stomach's bigger than that? Probably. Oh, uh, not really. It would be.